place where work, we are family, we love, we create, we give hugs, we give second chances, we say I'm oh, sorry, we value friendship, we make mistakes, we are real. This is lovely, absolutely stunning. A beautiful way to put to uh, decorate your stairs. Right, morning guys, Monday morning, 10 o'clock, waiting for the car to come round from the uh, concierge and the valet parking. So we checked out at the Bellevue Hotel. So I had the manager come over and talk to me this morning on breakfast because of the, uh, uh, the issues we had with nine items missing from the menu last night. Um, and we couldn't do the jet skiing because they don't have jet skis anymore or they're somewhere else. And the paragliding we couldn't do and we couldn't do the archery. Uh, and we had to go and do the dolphin watching outside and get somebody else to do it. So it's a really nice hotel. They know how to charge for the rooms, like 11,000 peso for a double. Um, the pool's very, very nice, a bit limited. Uh, food, very expensive. Very expensive. Uh, a 250 ml bottle of Perrier water, 400 pesos. Uh, San Miguel Light, 180 to 200 peso. So, yeah, very, very, very expensive. So, uh, I got my dry cleaning done last night. A couple of shorts, a couple of pants, a couple of bras, a couple of stuff. 3,000 peso. 3,000 peso. Thank you, Koya. Oh, there we go. Guys, we're here in uh, Tag Bilaran. There we go, I'm getting it. We just come to the museum. And the museum is shut on a Monday. Oh, there we go. How different. Uh, so we're going across the road to Rizzle Park. Because I don't think Rizzle Park is shut. Because they're doing some work on it. There we go. walk across the zebra crossing and they still want to try and run you over so it's the same in every Philippine city okay look at this there we go there we go the plaza of Taglibaran Okay, looks very, very nice. It's having some work done on it, it's being cleaned up. The museum is over here. Hello, Koya. Keep taking the drugs. There we go. Look at that. doing some work it's very nice but I don't know don't understand why all the men are hanging around under the trees with what darling they're trimming the trees so there's one tree and there's 50 people to trim the tree maybe they're gonna pull it over I don't understand this man's trimming the tree look at that That's lovely, yeah. Beautiful. Looking after the for looking after the area. Very, very nice. Oh, Rob, it's like your back garden. Did you fancy it? Yeah. There we go. They're putting a monument here. That's really, really nice work. Yeah. Very, very, very nice. There's a chimney. Walk around the back. So they put this monument here. I've done no written work on it. It's very, very nice. That's a beautiful church.
I'm going across the road. Unbelievable. Wherever I go in the Philippines, I am surprised and shocked at how beautiful some of the churches are. There we go. That is beautiful. Very, very beautiful. Entire work, masonry work. <laughs> so this is Church of Tag Bilara. today people are just relaxing So beautiful. Back outside. <laughs> what a lovely, lovely cathedral. So, we're in church. And Rob is taking it all in and admiring it. There he is. Internet is going down. She's on the right hand side. There we go. She comes zooming, zooming out of the subscribe button. This church is absolutely gorgeous. The church of Tag Le Baran on Bohol. I do struggle 
pronunciation of this city. Beautiful. So guys, uh, tonight is Monday, it's five o'clock. Uh, we purchased a ticket this morning to get on the Transasia, which leaves at seven o'clock. You have to come down the port uh, to finish your uh, registration. So, over here, and I'm not allowed to film over here because the security keep turning around telling me to get behind the yellow railings. So I'm behind the yellow railings. So on the right hand side there are some white buildings from Fast Cat, Super Cat uh, and then the Transasia is the little building, the little office, third one along. So you go in there, you turn around and give your paperwork, then they turn around, they ask you to go over to here. So where it says welcome port of uh, Tag Bilaran, you walk past that on the inside to the end building. Now, there is a building being repaired, but the other side of that building is a blue building where you need, so it's over here, down the back here. And you go there to get your uh, PPA, Port Authority Payment, or Port Payment Port Authority, Port Payment Authority. Uh, and that's 129 peso for all three of us and the car. You come back out here. Where are we? Just here and then the car is parked to my left uh, and then you can go back into the port through here but your passengers have to go through here so my brother and my partner have gone through here annie they've gone through this building here and they have to go through the payment uh, and the presentation of their document to go into departure at the moment i've been told that the uh, six o'clock is the earliest that I can go on to the vessel so I've just been to this guy here and he's turned around and said six o'clock uh, so this is the Bohol Beach Club they're waiting here uh, the car is parked over here there is a blue car that's parked there there is a toilet here and you can wait but a lot of the people a lot of the places they're just uh, reversed a lot of the cars are just doing a u-turn here where are we here they're coming round here and going this way but it's quite an organized port uh, no issues no problems the paperwork uh, they keep asking me for the registration of the car uh, which I give to them as uh, a ADC 155 or a 9 and they go from there but uh, yeah it's not too bad so that's uh, <coughs> Panglao in the distance and then there is the bridge over here that's one of two bridges if you go onto Google it's got lots of ferries going this way but there isn't any ferries going this way they all go out this way because the bridge is too low for them to get under but anyway I'm here I'm waiting for six o'clock and then I'll go and ask if I can go into the port and get ready to queue up to go onto the ship it's an eight hour to nine hour journey over to Kagyan to Yoro tonight. First time I've actually been, so let's see what happens. A first for all of us. Hey ho! Like, share and subscribe.